today. Oh my god! Location undisclosed. This one is crazy. <laughs> yeah. I mean, wow. Yeah. Um, you see, I'm wearing a mask, and you'll see why in a minute. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna have to put mine on too here in a minute. But uh, yeah, so we got this uh, abandoned building here. It's got some really cool games in it. That some of them are in pretty good disrepair. So we're gonna go check them out really quick. Quick. So this is a this is an old pick. Now these. Uh, Pinball machines are spoken for, but we got a blackout here that the dust is about blacked out, Mike. We got a space shuttle, a Trivia Whiz and a Defender Cab, got a Capcom Bowling, got a Gyrus, which is one I've been wanting, so I'm kind of glad we're getting a hold of that one. Uh, we got a Ghost and Goblins and a Track and Field Cab. We're not taking any of these pool tables. This was a pool hall at one point. Pretty neat. I gotta watch my step, guys. It's rough in here. This stuff hanging from the ceiling. We got an escape from the robot monsters. I'm kinda excited about that. See what's in there, board sets. Got some Atari joysticks that are helpful. And uh, it's in uh, what looks like a Mach 3 cab. Big old fat cabinet. So we're gonna step on some plywood here to make sure we don't die. Got a rare Bally Sente. I don't know what all we're gonna get because some of this stuff looks like it's pretty Falling apart, but uh, it's a mini golf. That's a cool game. And back here, it starts getting a little bit rougher. Again, I've got to watch the floor more than I watch the camera. Got a gold, an original golden tee and what looks like a, that right there is a Bosconian cabinet is what it looks like, which is crazy. And then there's a Russian attack. Another um, crime city and a track and field cabinet. And then there's a time pilot and a stern. So some cool games. Over here, we got a play choice 10, a 10 yard fight and what looks like a Stargate cabinet. A Monte Carlo and an old Berserk. Mike all masked up. Yeah, let's see what we can get out of that door thing. Hubert. I don't recognize the racing game, guys. Put it in the comments below. And then there's an Exidy crossbow, sadly. But uh, unfortunately, there's not much left of them. Yeah, the bloody. Yeah, that one's been mushed. So. We're going to get a few of these. We'll see what we can find. <laughs> see what we can find in here and get to get back to Starship and see what we get. <laughs> well, Ryan, I thought I was going to get you a Cubert cab today, but uh, this bad boy is unfortunately unsalvageable. And I, ain't, I just can't get it out. I sure can't get this. Out. I don't even know what this game is called. It's driving me crazy. This is a real shame here. Exidy crossbow. And just killed. Dead, dead, dead. I know some people are going to watch this and be really uh, saddened by the state of things, but you're going to be more sad if I get collapsed on. So, anyway, I'm going to pick off a couple of things and then get out of the way. These nice workers here. Try to save Mike before he gets killed in here. We got a few though, we'll see what we get. again at Bucky's if you can see that in the background and uh, we got Mike here eating a sandwich I got me a little bit of a little southwest wrap and a tea there but uh, Mike was super hungry he can't even make it in the cab he had to go down to eat here but uh, yeah here at Bucky's as we seem to always be and here's some of our arcade picks well they're rough bud but 
Hey, this is Holly Stark. Here's a play choice. Got this Capcom bowling again. Don't know if we're going to keep that. Um, you know, it has a monitor in it, so that's the plus there. Then we have this gyrus that looks to be in pretty good shape. I'm excited about that one. We end up getting this Ghost and Goblins in a track and field cab. Uh, you know, got the Century coin door on it. Super excited about that. Here's the Stargate with the uh, 10 yard fight. This one should be fun on the inside. It's an Escape from Robot Monsters. It's got Atari logo joysticks. Uh, I don't know. I mean, I'm hoping the board sets work in some of these. I know we can always get the monitors going. Got a trivia whiz. It's in a nice Defender cabinet. So some of the cabinets are solid, the ones we got. Some, not so much. I mean, there's some that are a little rough on the bottom. Uh, the Cuber completely was falling apart, but I did salvage all the boards out of it. I salvaged the monitor out of it. Uh, we were able to get uh, like a marquee and the bezel, bezel glass, the little plastic around it. So pretty much the guts of the Cubert. So anyway, a nice little pick and uh, one of the most dirty, dangerous ones we've had for sure. So uh, coming away with a few bumps and bruises. He felt, Mike fell through the floor in there. So, uh, you know, it was pretty scary. So I was scared, but anyway. We'll get them home and uh, hope you like this kind of stuff. We're laying our bodies on the line for you, YouTubers. So, is that a good sandwich? Mm. All right. <laughs> All right, so we got a few of these busted ones out here. Uh, took some of the parts off of them that will be useful in the future. You know, PCBs, coin doors, monitors parts these i'm just gonna give away so they'll be gone by the time you see this video i'm sure uh but uh anyway gonna move those but here's this is probably the outside the play choice 10 which i've already moved off the truck it's probably the best thing in the auction or the auction the uh the pick there it's the gyrus obviously we don't know if it's got working order or not but it's good because it's never been converted Looks like it was last operating in 91. Um, got a gyrus burn. So, you know, I have no idea if this thing will light up, come on, do anything. But the side art is really good. You know, it has original stenciled side art. Um, anyway, so a really nice piece. I and mean, I had to take some other stuff on that I really didn't care to have. You know, it's even got a back door, which, you know, it's pretty clean, no water damage. So we're excited about that one. On the truck still, we got a Defender cab and a track and field. There's a Ghost and Goblins in the track and field, which I think is a good a good get. And then this has Trivia Whiz. We have some parts to make that silkworm real easy, like drop in. So anyway, can't turn my phone around here. Anyway. Uh, we're gonna try out this gyrus and that'll probably be the end of this thing. All right, last video from this pick. Uh, got the gyrus inside. I've got everything unloaded from the truck. It's been a long day and I am tired. But uh, open up the gyrus. I unplugged the board, tested the power supply. The power supply is still shooting good. Heard the monitor get all crunchy and crispy when I turned Turn it on the power supply. I haven't powered the board, so I'm gonna do that on camera now and see if anything comes up. Maybe nothing, and that's okay. Uh, we're gonna find out. So I don't see anything in the marquee. Oh my god! <laughs> I can't believe it came up. Hold on, let me get the lights a little bit here. I'm literally shocked. <laughs> I was uh, joking with Mike yesterday that, uh, oh, it's gonna fire right up. And uh, looks like there's a little glitch or something. Well, I thought I saw one in the middle there. That's actually pretty good. Let's see, uh, <laughs> does this help? Let's see if it coins up. Oh my God. Working out of that mess. Where's the one player button? I don't know how to hit one player on this thing. Uh, oh, there it went. 
Son of a gun. Uh, we got left and right, so not a Monroe stick. Yeah, it's a working game, man. That's crazy. Can you believe that, guys? This gyrus is working. Literally, I did nothing. I promise I did nothing. You can tell the light's not even on it, but all I did was open up the bag and test the power supply. And uh, there you go. Wow. Unreal. And it looks good. Like, this has probably been, this gyrus has probably been out of commission for since 91. So we're like 30 years. <laughs> it's ridiculous. Like, I, I'm, I'm guessing, I talked to the guy, he said he used to go to that pool hall and uh, he said he went when he was like 15. The guy's probably my age, so that makes a, some sense. So yeah, 30 years later, and it fired right up, to be honest with you. Like I said, I can see a little glitchy across the planet, maybe, maybe. So, well, what do you think, guys? Uh, a dangerous score, falling through the floor, breathing in old dust and all that fun stuff. Uh, but I think we got some really cool stuff. Uh, hopefully I'll get this gyrus all cleaned up and get it on the floor. If you like content like this, remember to like and subscribe. Um, set the alert so you know when we have new videos come out. But I'm super, super excited. I cannot believe that lit up. I was totally joking with Mike yesterday saying, hey, I think that gyrus gonna light right up when I plug it in. I was really joking. I didn't think it would. So uh, anyway, I'm impressed and I'm happy. So uh, thanks for watching the video. Thanks uh, for supporting us here at the Electric Starship Arcade. And uh, we'll make some more videos and see you again soon. Unreal, unreal.